YouTube, Texas Charizard here, and today I have a Pokemon TCG online pack opening. Um, I've been getting into the TCG a lot more lately, and I opened up a booster box and a few packs, so I have some codes here, and I'm just going to open up these packs. For some reason, it takes a little while to load the packs now. Um, but anyway, uh, I'm looking to build the Fighting Crobat deck. Uh, with Halucha, Landorus. I'm also looking for um, Trevenant, Shaman as well. So, see what we get here. And we get a Drapion Rare, so that's not too exciting there. We're looking for a uh, Halucha Hollow, uh, maybe even some strong energy fighting stadium. See what we get in this next pack. We get a Karina and a Training Center. We're not looking for any of those. And we get a Pangoro. Alright, so not, another not too exciting pack. Next up. No trainers there. And our rare is... A Glaceon regular rare. Alright, so come on, let's get something good out of this last Furious Fist pack. Nothing again. No trainers at all. And Electivire. So wow, those were not very good. Let's move on to Phantom Forces. Um, looking for maybe some uh, Gengar EX. Um... Shaman Trevenant might not even be as good anymore with the ban of Lysander's Trump card. So maybe Gengar Trevenant might be a deck to look out for in the future. So uh, we'd be looking for maybe some Crobat, Crobat Line, and uh, some Gengar. So let's see what we get here. Only have three packs, so you can't really uh, expect to get much. We get a Dimension Valley, a Shauna, a Sycamore. And a haunch grow. So there's a that's a bunch of good trainers right there. Reverse sycamore. That's pretty good. That was a, a solid pack. Let's see, what we get in the next one. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be coming out with a few deck reviews. Definitely going to be trading more um, for cards I need in decks. We got a pumpkaboo. This is a night march deck. X cavalier and. A glide score. So again, nothing too exciting there. Hopefully we can get something good out of this Phantom Forces pack. Robo substitutes alright. Man, Bronzong's a decent card. Uh, I'm not really looking to play metal, but sorry, so now we have 36 packs of Roaring Skies. Hopefully the um after these first few take a little while to load, the next ones will be a lot quicker. But anyway, yeah, we're looking for... I mean, if we get Shaman, we get some Rayquazas. That's definitely we can use as trade bait to get what we need. So, um, let's just crack into these, see what we get. We get a Mega Turbo. And a Shinninja, alright. I know that's a... I mean... It's not maybe not that playable, but it's a pretty cool card. Alright, next pack here. Just trying to open these as fast as possible. And we get a Zatu. Man, we have not been doing too well. Hopefully we can get something good. We have 34 more packs. We should get a few EXs. Double Dragon, Ultra Ball, and an Unpheasant. Alright. At least the packs are loading up a lot faster now. We get a Wally. Okay, I know that's pretty good in a uh, Trevenant deck. And we get another Zatu. What is going on? Get an Inkata, Healing Scarf, Klefki, 
and beautify. Again, nothing really at all that I'm going to use or to trade away. Trainer's mail, that's good. And a binet, another nothing. Like that, I wonder what's going on here. I've seen a lot of TCG online pack openings, and you tend to get pretty good pulls. Rayquaza Spirit Link and an Articuno. Alright, so we're like seven packs in, really haven't gotten anything. Let's see what we get here. Alright, we got a Wino, that's pretty good. And a Reshiram. I know that's a decent card. It says once during your turn, if this Pokemon is your active, you may attach a fire type energy card from your hand to one of your dragon type Pokemon. So I know that's you know, it's not the best, but it's definitely better than what we've been getting before. So let's see what this next pack brings us. They're definitely loading up. Lickety split now. There's our Halucha, but that's not the good one. And we get Talonflame. Man. Alright, come on. Let's get something, something good here. Here we go. All right, we got a Rayquaza EX. That's our first EX. Um, you know, and there's not much to say. I know some people use the, the Dragon type Mega Rayquaza, but um, I know that the Colorless one is uh, a lot better. But you know, I can't complain. We finally get an EX. Oh, that's pretty cool. A lot of trainers in that pack. That was good. And another Reshiram. Hopefully we get, oh, there's an email pops up there. You get an Articuno and a Dragonite. All right, that's a pretty cool pack. I know Dragonite's, Dragonite's pretty cool. And our rare, another Dragonite. Man, what is What's up with these packs? I know Dragonite's somewhat playable as a, like a techie card. Next pack up here, we get another Latio Spirit Link and another Shedinja. Man, what is ah, this? Is pretty disappointing, to be honest. I, I honestly expected to get a lot better cards here. Honestly, getting nothing. <laughs> Except that Rayquaza and another non hollow rare. Man, what the heck? Let me know if you guys get this sort of pack luck on here. I know usually you get a lot of better cards. Dust stocks. Come on now. Give us some good cards here. Trainers mail again, that's good. We're definitely getting good trainers. That's a positive. We're getting good trainers. But we're just not getting good Pokemon. <laughs> and our rare. That's like our ninth Articuno. See what we got here. Got another Wally, a Ninjask, and an Unpheasant. I think I'm going to open up a few more packs here. If I'm not getting anything, I'm going to close out the game and like reset. So we'll see. Skarmory. Alright, I think this is going to be our last pack here today. See what we get. We got two rares here. I'm gonna go with this one first. Zapdos and Victini. Alright, this is definitely disappointing. 
I want to thank you guys for watching though. Definitely stay tuned for um, some trade videos uh, for anyone who's looking to build decks as I am. So I want to thank you guys for watching and peace.